from Moasir book, lesson one and two, page 22. In this year, 2024, okay? Look at with me about question number one. Choose the correct answer, four divided by third. Four divided by third, we can solve this example by write four and convert from division to multiplication, write the inverse about subtraction here, three, three over one will be three, and three times four equal 12, means the result will be letter C, 12. Question number two, eight, question number two, eight divided by half. We can solve the example by write eight and convert from division to multiplication and write the inverse about one over two to be two, two times eight equals 16. Question number three, half divided by eight. We can solve the example right half and convert from division to multiplication, write the inverse about eight will be one over eight. And then one product by one equals one and two times eight equals 16, the result will be one over 16. Question number four, fourth divided by five. Here we can write fourth and convert from division to multiplication and write the inverse about five, it will be one over five. One times one equal one, four times five equal 20, the result will be one over 20. Next question, number five. Four divided by third, you can write four and convert from division to multiplication, raise the inverse about one over three, it will be three over one. Three over one equal three times four equal 12. Question number six. Two over seven divided by two. First, we can write two over seven and convert from division to multiplication. Two over seven. And write the verse about two, one over two. We can cancel two divided by two, one, two divided by two, one. One times one equal one, one times seven equal seven. The result will be one over seven. Question number seven. Four, four over five divided by two. We can write four over five and convert from division to multiplication, write the inverse about two, it will be one over two. And then you can sample this fraction by divided by two, two divided by two equal one, four divided by two equal two. And then one times two equal two, one times five equal five, the result will be two over five. What shall letter eight? Five divided by three over six, you can write five and convert from division to multiplication, write the inverse about three over six, it will be six over three. Okay, and then we can write six divided by three equal two, then the result will be five product by two will be equal ten. Question number nine. Four over five divided by half. We can write four over five, convert from division to multiplication, and write the inverse about one over two to be two over one. Two times four equal eight, one times five equal five. You can convert five, eight divided by five equal one, and the remainder three. Because it's in blue bar, you can convert from row bar to mixed number. Eight divided by five equal one, and the remainder three. Question number 10. Three over eight divided by three over four. You can write three over eight and convert from division to multiplication. Write the inverse about three over four, it will be four over three. Three divided by three equal one, three divided by three equal one, four divided by four equal one, eight divided by four equal two. And then one times one equal one, one times two equal two, the result will be one over two. Next question, number 11. Three-fifths of liter, question 11. Three-fifths of a liter container is filled with a water. 
If a Mac can contain three over ten of liter, then how many Macs of water are need to fill up packed? We can find the number by using division between two numbers. We have three over five liter of container filled well liter. If a mug can contain three over ten liter, okay. Look at here this image here. We have container. We have three fifths liter of water. Three fifths liter of water, and we will filled a lot of a lot of mug. Each one of them will be contain three over ten liter. How many mug here? How many mugs of water are need to fill up the packet? We want to find how many mug here. How many mug we, we have here? Three fifths liter, and we will divide this amount here to a lot of mugs, and each of them will contain of three over ten liter. We want to find how many mugs here. Can you tell me how many mugs of water are need to fill up the packet? We can write the number of max it will be 3 over 5 the total amount divided by 3 over 10 and then you can solve example by write first friction here and convert from division to multiplication and write the inverse about 3 over 10 it will be 10 over 3 and then 3 divided by 3 equal 1 3 divided by 3 equal 1 1 product by 10 equal 10 1 times 5 equal 5 10 divided by 5 equal 2 then the result will be equal to 10 divided by 5 equal 2 then we will found what two only we will we want to max only we need how many mark we need to mark to uh, distribute all amount here from three fifths liter of water to each of them contains three over ten liter we want to find how many mark we want to max okay it was question 11. Uh, what about question 12? Question 12. Noah uses four nine cups of milk to make two mugs of Miss Coffee. Okay. She has four over nine cups of cup of milk to make two mugs. It's cup of milk. We want to distribute this amount in two max of Nescafe. How many milk required to make a mug of Nescafe? Four, five, four over nine cups of milk. We will write four over nine. This amount divided to two max. We can find the number here by convert from division to multiplication here. Write four over nine and convert from division to multiplication. Write the inverse about 2, it will be 1 over 2, and then 4 divided by 2 equal 2, and 2 divided by 2 equal 1, and then 1 times 2 equal 2, 1 times 9 equal 9, then we can write 2 over 9. How much milk is required to uh, milk one mug of Nescafe? It will be 2 over 9, 2 over 9 cup. Choose letter C.